Ah, oh, greetings. It's me, the Sharpie Puss Potato. And welcome. We are going to be playing a little bit of Farming Simulator. Just because, you know, I fancied a break from the uh, hustle and bustle of uh, Tushima. So we're hopping in. We're going to just uh, jump in here and uh, like see what this is about. So yeah, Sharpie Puss is on the job. Um, vehicle, let's go. Yep. And equipment, let's take everything. Let's go for it. Confirm contract. Go. So we're going to be like mowing a little front lawn here. I think it should be quite uh, quite exhilarating, honestly. So yeah, this looks like a nice uh, British cottage. Quite expensive, if I do say so. They've got a nice car there, you know. So yeah, looks good. Looks like a nice location. I, I would like to live here. Ground check phase. At the start of each contract, you have a small period of time to find and remove any objects from the grass that could either be damaged or damage your vehicle. You can choose to skip the ground check if you have objects automatically removed. No, I don't. Oh, look at this car. Is that an Aston Martin or something? That's, uh, that's saucy, that is. Or a Jag. Could be a Jag, you know. I think that's a Jag. Anyway, let's, uh, let's have a little, little look around. Look at that. That could have destroyed my blades. Oh, what's this? Oh, gosh. Are they trying to sabotage me here? You know, I'm I'm all for it, but this is just... This is... This feels like it was, you know, planned. Like, look. A rocket? Really? That's what it's come to? Oh, what now? What is that? That looks like a big turd. What is that? Is that a turd? Yeah, that's a turd. You know, I'm all up for a turd here and there, but not when I'm going to be mowing. You don't want to mow over a turd. That's never a good experience, if I do say so. Okay, I think we're good. Any more sabotages? No? Okay, you better not. Better not be. Is that it, yeah? Hopefully. Anyway, let's get to it. Let's get on our trusty mower. Hello, hello. Oh, I need to get on from the side, I think. Yeah, here we go. Career mode. Okay, so I need to see. They want it at five to six centimeters. Recommended finish time within half an hour. Okay, so let's uh, whack the throttle up or start the engine. Sorry. Throttle is up. Uh, cutting is a. We'll do it at five. Uh, let's drive on to the old uh, grass. I think we'll start right here, this side. Okay, let's uh, line it up. Don't want to damage uh, flowers, but at the same time, you know, it's what you pay for. Let's go. Yeah, well, camera's very finicky in this game to start with. Okay, it's going okay. You know, if I destroy some flowers, that's on. That's her problem. You know, she didn't say not to mow the flowers. So, you know, we can speed this up. Yeah, let's speed up a little bit. This is nice. This is a good... This is, whoa, look at that. She tried to sabotage me, you know? She's trying to, like, muck me up here by planting her plants too close to the grass. It's all part of her plan. She, she basically wants me to mow the lawn for free because she'll say, I'm not paying you because you just destroyed my daisies. And I'll be like, look, lady, they were way too close to the grass. It was impossible to not plow them. Okay, this is going to be a, a weird situation. I'm going to have to maybe reverse in here. Oh, gosh. Yeah. You know. Yeah, that's... Uh, I might need the trimmer for this bit, honestly. Or we can just go for it. Yeah, this is... Pro mowing right here. Sort of. 
come on. I need to get all them bits out. We'll, we'll use the trimmer there, to be honest. Uh, be easier. Let's carry on. Plowing through. Yeah, it's those bits. They're, like, awkward, you know? How am I going to do anything there? We're going to speed this up. We're going to go max speed here. Look at this. This bush is way too close. There we go. Whoa! Okay. Okay. Whoa. We're good, we're good. See, that was the hardest part. This bit should be fairly... Fairly straightforward now, to be honest, apart from those side bits, but you know, we'll do those when we come to it. So, yeah, I always like to keep like one wheel just in the uh, in the like previously mode section, it just means that you're, you're guaranteed to get all those little straggly bits there, you know. So, yeah, I think. Uh, I think this is good. This is oh, look, a miss, miss, cut a corner there. See, that's that's what happens when you don't pay attention. But when I'm mowing the lawn in real life, I don't have one of these tractors. But uh, same thing, you know, if you can line it up, so either the wheels or the sort of if you've got one of them flat mowers, you just line it up just ever so slightly so it overlaps. And uh, if you want to be really sexy when you mow, you can. Uh, change the uh, adjust the blade uh, height for the every second row and you get that nice sort of you know cross effect it looks uh, looks pretty saucy but you you just want to make sure you're not starting too low because you know if uh, if you want to start low and then go lower then you know you're going to have a bad time it's best to start like one up from what you would want because it always looks nice when the the first row is a little bit higher, and then every second row in is lower. That's the way. So yeah, this is uh, this is nice. The volume's a bit low. I'm gonna just wipe the volume up for you because I turned it down because it was incredibly loud, honestly. But this this should be good. There we go. I think that's a bit better. Hopefully, you really experience the. Uh, the mowing sound and the the birds and the bees and stuff so yeah it's nice we're gonna have to go back and eventually uh you know fix those bits we cut the corner on but either way i think we're gonna do a good job here the middle bit will be hard it's tight tight around there but we'll see what we can do But yeah, this is a nice, nice house, nice garden, well kept. You know, I'd appreciate if they came out and just said, "Do you want a cuppa?" And I'd be like, "Yeah, just you know, leave leave it on the wall there, leave it on the bench, and I'll uh, I'll get it when I come round." That's what I'd say. But yeah, you can't can't always get what you want when you're a contractor like this, you know. Sometimes they'll just be peeking out the window at you and making sure you're not running over the daisies, but you know that and that adds extra pressure honestly. Like you're gonna you're gonna feel that pressure, those eyes on you. It's, you you're more prone to make mistakes. So people, you know, people watching when you get older and you're not you're not able to do this anymore and you need to hire someone like this, just keep your eyes off them, you know? You can people can sense when they're being watched and uh it's best to just leave them to it, you know? Just let them get on with their job, you know? He's obviously got some tunes banging out on those headphones. They're actually, like, earphones, so they, you know, cancel out the noise. But I bet he's listening to some, like, hardcore metal or rock or something. Or maybe even... Maybe he's a total, like, you know, a shocker. Maybe he's listening to, like, Barbie Girl or something like that, you know? Depends. Or maybe some classical music while you're doing this. Personally, I like a bit of uh, stuff with some oomph to keep you going. Because, like, when I'm mowing in uh, in our garden, it's sort of like uh, there's a, there's a few hills, there's a few sections where you have to really, you know, put all your strength behind it. And when you've got a, a tune with a good solid beat, like you know, trying to 
give you some oomph. That's that's what you need. Oh, I just cut a corner there. That's terrible. But, you know, sometimes you've just got to go for it when you're mowing. Just whack on those earphones. Put on the noise cancellation if you've got it. Tell you what, I will uh, give you a tip to all you mowers. If you want to invest in some good earphones or uh, earpods sort of thing, you know, the in-ear little things, the ones you stick in your ear, Get the Google uh, Pro. I, I don't know if they're called Google Pixel Buds or something, but get the Pro version of them. They are insane. The noise cancellation is freaking amazing when you're mowing. You can't even hear the mower. Like, sometimes I could be walking around with the, the mower totally turned off, and I wouldn't be able to tell. Like, I, I um, even when it's on, you can't tell. Gosh, I totally ruined the flowers there. But, you know, that's that's what I'm saying. It's it, You really, the only way you'd know is if you sort of, you know, see the actual grass being cut sort of thing. And, uh, yeah, it's really good. The only downside is, you know, if someone's trying to call your name or something or offer you a cuppa, you are not going to hear them. So you have to keep your eyes peeled, you know. Watch them waving at the, from the front door, offering that cuppa for you. Maybe... These these people here are obviously rich, to be honest. So I wonder, is he going to just, like, give me that jag when we're done? You know, he's he's at the end of his line, I reckon, the owner of this house. And he's just like, you know, I've got no family. I've got no children. But this guy, this guy mowing my lawn, he's a solid lad. And he deserves my jag. So that's what's going to happen there. That is my form of payment. And then, you know, with that jag, we can equip some side blades to it. And, you know, if we ever get a contract in a really big sort of field or something like that, we'll use the jag. Why not? You know, there's no there's no farmer's rules or lawnmower's rules saying that you can't mow with a jaguar. You know? Sometimes you've got to just bend the rules ever so slightly. Not lot, not break them, just bend them. Like, twist them a little bit, you know? Look at that. That corner was subtle. That was that was a nice corner. Okay, here we go. You get a bit closer there. Plow it in, plow it in. There we go. See, now you could go left there, but to be honest, it just doesn't feel right when you do that. You've got to keep that pattern going in the natural direction. Otherwise, it, it just looks crap, honestly, when you when you ruin the direction of it. So, you know, always go around the same ways. Now, this is getting tight here, you see? We're going to have to really... Oh, yeah. And here as well, see? Bring it in. Bring it round. Oh, destroyed a flower, fine occurred. Oh, I've got a fine. See, she's actively fining me, like, on the spot. So she's there with a notepad and pen. And every time she sees a flower, she's, like, docking my payment, basically. Like, I, I don't appreciate that. If... Oh, look at this. This is terrible. Um, it's, it's not good. And honestly, when she's doing that, it just makes me want to, you know, ruin more of her flowers. So she better just stop. Stop her shenanigans, you know? I'm not here to destroy flowers, I'm here to mow a lawn, but if you're going to plant your flowers too close, then what do you expect me to do, really, you know? I'm not going to go out of my way to avoid your flowers. I'll try. Oh, look, penalty fine occurred again, see? She's really taking the biscuit, she is. Okay, good. I think this might be... Whoa, whoa, yeah, yeah. Take that, flowers. Okay. Then we'll do this. Okay, going to turn the blades off. Because I don't want to ruin the the mystique. We're at 90%, so look all them birds over there. Okay. Blades on, let's go. Finish this section. Look at them there. Definitely peeking through those stained glass windows. They're thinking, ah, oh, it's alright, they can't see... This, this chap who's mowing our lawn, he can't see that we're watching him. But trust me, I can. I can sense you watching. 
and I'm gonna just because they're watching I'm gonna totally ruin the pattern here and I'm gonna go left right instead and yeah, see how they like that why not I'll, I'll, I'll even do a bit of reversing see how they like the reverse mo yeah not as accurate because I don't I'm not got my camera set up correctly Yeah, see? Totally ruined. Ruined the immersion. Oh, fine occurred. Yeah, no problem. I'm used to it by now. There we go. There we go. We're doing it. We're doing it. Missed a few spots. Let's clean this up. And there, look been skipping it all over the place little little patches but then again they, they don't deserve a perfect lawn after all these sabotaging you know first of all with the dog toy the turd the rocket and then planting the flowers too close it's just just taking the biscuit really isn't it look i'm on 98 percent if if i get to 100 percent and there's a little blade of grass left i'm purposely leaving that as spite you know like, and every time they walk out, they'll see that little patch of grass that I've missed. And they'll think, God, we shouldn't have been watching him. He would have done a perfect job otherwise. But because we were watching, he destroyed like five of my flowers. Yeah, there you go, see? And I bet there's a few patches. Of, yeah, see over there, there's a patch of grass. But, you know, not my problem. Oh, sorry. Is that me who left that? What a shame, you know? Maybe I'll just run over some flowers on the way out. Oh, look. And these? Yeah, you didn't say that you wanted them done. So, yeah, I left that as well. There should be a option to just turn and stick your middle finger up for them, basically. Because that's, that's the amount of thanks I feel that I got from that. You know, and maybe I'll just, like, you know, reverse into his jag by mistake. Oh, sorry, mate. Yeah, that was my bad. You know, accidents happen. Don't hold it against me. And as for the grass, leaving that here, that's your problem, not mine. I'll see you later. So then I'm just like, you know, whacking down the throttle, engine off, getting off. Refill the fuel. They they will need to pay for the fuel, honestly. Use the trimmer. I might just go and uh, trim some, you know, some, uh, maybe this. No. What about flowers? Yeah, there you go. Ooh. Yeah, take that. That's what you get. Never coming back here. What's that? Equipment must be stored. Oh, okay. There we go. Okay. Yeah, job done. Old Nook Cottage. <laughs> Absolute sabotage that was. From the get-go. Did we get an achievement? Anything for that? Oh, look at all them fines. How many penalties and fines? 11 quid. I got docked 11 quid for that, but paid 311. That was a really good deal, honestly. Blimey. You know, that took me 30 minutes and I got paid 311 quid. If I was in Poland and I... It, the amount of garden I have to mow in my garden... I would be a millionaire, I think. That's uh, that's funny. Okay, yeah, accept all. There we go. Every story has a beginning. Sorted. So, yeah, that was... Oh, look, the first of many. Nice. Honestly, I like this game. It's good. It's just chill. It's like, you know, when you're not in the mood for a... Like, you know, you just want to chill, this is the game for you, honestly. I only got two... Uh, not even two stars. I got one and a half. We might have to try that again professionally, but you know, for now, that's all I wanted to show you. Just a little bit of uh, mowing. So that's, you know, you just saw 20 minutes of me mowing lawn. How do you feel about that? I feel pretty good. I don't know about you, but anyway, have a good morning, a good afternoon, a good evening, or a good night, and I shall see you next time. I've been Sharpie Puss Potato. You've been you. Thank you very much. Peace.